Hey everyone, Ledbetter17P here. Today we have a juice review for you guys. Uh, it's been a while since I've done a juice review, so I figure, hey, I might as well get back here and do it for you guys. So we are going to be reviewing this right here. This is Killer Custard Strawberry from Vaptasia. This is a brand new juice that I just got in uh, two days ago. I've gone through two tanks in two days uh, just to test it out. And I figure, what the hell, I will do a review on this juice so you guys can check it out. Now, this is the box that it comes in. Uh, neat little box. We'll hold that up so you guys can see a little bit better. It says Vape Tasia across the top. Has that neat little uh, cartoon character with the, uh, the eye patch and the little strawberry dude. It says Killer Custard Strawberry. As you can see, it's a 100 ml uh, bottle, 3 milligram. On the sides, just a continuation of the image. On the back, some warning information and ingredients and whatnot. Uh, social media stuff. On the top, it says Vape Tasia Killer Custard Strawberry. And the same thing on the bottom. All right, so that is the box itself. Uh, we're going to look at three different things, really, with this review. Uh, we're going to look at packaging. Uh, vapor production and flavor. We're going to rate everything on a 1 to 10 scale. Uh, 1 being the worst, 10 being the best. So here is the bottle that came inside that. This is a 100 ml Gorilla bottle. Uh, this is one of those uh, Gorilla bottles there. It has a little Gorilla icon on the bottom. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see that or not. Probably not. But this is one of the really nice bottles. Uh, I use Gorilla bottles for, uh, I have a bunch of 30 mil ones that I use for DIY stuff uh, that are great. Uh, so here is the juice itself. Great packaging. Awesome label. Matches the box 100%. Uh, has all that information there. On this side, pretty much all the information you need. Tells you what milligram, how much VGPG, size of the bottle, ingredients, and whatnot. Does say nicotine on the top. Uh and on the next side, it says, follow us on Instagram. Has their Instagram right there. Uh, on the other side, there is some warning labels. Tell you, basically, you know, don't be an idiot, right? All right. Child safety cap. You know, really not easy to get into. Uh, definitely a nice child safety cap. When you open this bottle, like so. Nice little needle top. Easy to fill tanks and whatnot uh, so really good now the plastic for this bottle uh, that's the only downside to it like these are the good bottles but it's that harder to push harder to squeeze plastic it's not that uh it's not like this kind of plastic that's really really soft and easy to squeeze uh, so with these over time you can get creases in the bottle uh, i've already got a little crease right there from you know the way i've been using it so all right, so bottle packaging, definitely a 10 out of 10 for these guys. They've definitely hit it out of the park. Everything that I like to see on a bottle is there. Uh, the only thing that's not there is a born-on date and an expiration date, but that's not really a big deal. Uh, pretty much all the other safety stuff is there that you need to have. So definitely a 10 out of 10. So we have it loaded up today in the... Uh, what is this thing? It's a Limitless Plus RDTA. Uh, just running a very simple build. Nothing too fancy. Some cotton bacon with some uh, 22 gauge, uh, 2.5 mil, uh, like 11 wrap stainless steel coils. Uh, that's ohming out at, let's see, 0.13 on this device. Now the device that I am using... I will be reviewing at some point in the future. Uh, this is the Smock T-Priv, 220-watt uh, mod that I just picked up. Really nice looking. It's a little dirty. Uh, it's got juice on it from using it and stuff. I'll definitely get it all cleaned up before I do a review on it. But let's go ahead and give it a quick vape, and uh, we'll talk about vapor production now. So let's go ahead and give this thing a quick little dose, and let's give it a vape. Now, keep in mind, this juice is a 70 VG, 30 PG mix. So you're not going to get gigantic clouds on it, but you're still going to get really decent clouds. Uh, 
but you're you're going to get a tiny bit of a throw hit with it as well, uh, which I was a little surprised. I'm a high VG vapor. I don't really do PG in my juices, so this juice has taken me a little bit to get used to because of the PG, but I actually really enjoy the throw hit. Uh, really enjoy everything about it. So vapor production for what it is, uh, for what my build is and everything, I'm definitely going to give it a 10 out of 10. Uh, now keep in mind that will vary depending on your setup, depending if you're using a tank, you know, uh, depending if you're using an RDA or an RDTA, uh, it's going to really uh, depend on what your build is uh, and what your coils are and stuff like that. So keep in mind that your vapor production may vary. It's not going to be the same as mine. You may get more or less. So keep that in mind. All right, so flavor. This is a custard and strawberry. Uh, it's like a vanilla custard with just a hint of strawberry. Now, the strawberry is not a candied strawberry, uh, but the strawberry is definitely in your face. Uh, it is, boom, you taste it right away. Just smelling the juice, you can smell the strawberry. Uh, the custard is a really low-key thing. Uh, it's kind of a... It's kind of a, a base. It's in the background behind that strawberry saying, hey, I'm still here. Uh, you get a little tiny hint of the vanilla with that strawberry, so it gives it a bit of a creaminess, which is very, very nice. Uh, the flavor is very smooth, uh, to tell you the truth. Uh, definitely a juice I would buy again. And like I said, I bought this bottle through eSiggity. Uh, they run 22 bucks for a... Uh, 100 mil bottle like this uh, you can find it some other places for about 20 bucks uh, i'd shop around uh, i got lucky and got it for 12 dollars and 67 cents because i had a bunch of points through e siggity from previous purchases so i was able to uh get a 12 almost 13 dollar store credit so it took about half the price off for me but definitely really really good let's give it another vape You get that little bit of a throw hit right in the back, which is very, very nice. Uh, really, really nice. And uh, you get a uh, really nice creamy strawberry flavor with that custard as well. So definitely a thumbs up for me. 10 out of 10 on the flavor. 10s across the board. Uh, definitely check this juice out. It is Vaptasia Killer Custard Strawberry. And uh, that is pretty much it for this review. Uh, hope you guys enjoy what you see. If you like what you see, go ahead and click that like button down below. Leave a comment in the comment section with any questions or concerns, and I'll do my best to get back to you as soon as possible. And don't forget to share and subscribe. So until next time, I am Ledbetter17P. Keep on vaping.